Google Takeout is a pretty good tool that allows you to download your data from Google. You can download all your emails from Gmail or all your files from Google Drive, all your photos from Google Photos and other things like that. And Tim has a lot of other videos about how you can actually use Google Takeout. But really the biggest issue with Google Takeout is if you're downloading a lot of files, those files will often end up being split into multiple different zip files. So often your files that were all nicely organized are now split into multiple chunks and have to be merged together. So in this video, Timmy's going to show you how you can merge them all back together after you've downloaded everything to your Mac. The first thing you'll need to do is just extract each zip file if you haven't already. So as we can see, we've got all these zip files from Google Takeout in the downloads folder here. And we'll just need to go through and double click on each one of them to extract them. So we'll double click on this one, double click on this one, double click on this one, and so on. So this can take a little while if you have quite a few zip files, but we've done that now. So we've extracted all of these zip files out into these folders. So we have a folder for each zip file that we had basically. And now once you've extracted the files out of the zip files, you can actually go ahead and delete all the zip files. You don't necessarily have to, but it's just neater if they're not in the way. So to me, we'll delete those zip files there. And now you'll be left with all these folders. So you'll have a folder named takeout, and then you'll have takeout two, takeout three, takeout four, etc. But now you need to merge all of these folders together into one folder. And luckily the macOS finder app does have a function that can merge these folders together quite easily, but it can't do it right now because they're all named slightly different things because they're in the same place. So they had to be named something different. So we have to do something to kind of trick it into actually merging them. Well, not really tricking, kind of tricking. So the best way to me is found to do this is to create a new temporary folder right here. So if you right click just on a blank space in the finder app somewhere and click new folder, you can name this anything you want. We'll just call it merging. We'll delete it in like 10 minutes anyway. So we'll name it merging and we've got this folder here named merging. And now with the takeout here, so the folder that has no number at the end of it and it's just named takeout, We'll click and drag that and drop it into the merging folder. So we have takeout inside merging here. And now before we do that with the rest of them, we'll need to rename them one folder at a time. So probably best if we start with takeout two, we will right click on takeout two and click rename. And then we will delete the two from the name and the space. So it's just takeout and press enter to save that. So now this folder is just named takeout and we couldn't do that before because there was already a folder in here named takeout, but that folder is now in the merging folder. So now we have another folder here named takeout, which is the same name as what's inside the merging folder. So now we can select this folder and now we need to hold down the option key on the keyboard. So hold down the option key on your max keyboard. And then while holding that key down, click and drag the takeout folder and drop it into the merging folder. But it will pop up with this message here saying a folder named takeout already exists in this location. Do you want to merge or replace with the one you're copying? And we of course want to merge. So we'll go ahead and click merge and when it does this, it actually only copies this folder into here. So it's still here now, but we can now right click on it and delete that folder there. And now inside the merging folder, we still only have one folder named takeout, but this will be a combination of the first two folders and they'll all be merged together perfectly. So we've done that with the first two now. And if that's all you had, you're pretty much done. 
But if you have several more folders like this, you would basically just need to repeat the process over and over again. So we have takeout three here, we will rename that to takeout, hold option and drop it into merging and click merge. And then we will delete that folder and repeat with all the others. And now all of those folders have been merged inside the merging folder. So if we go inside here, we'll just have one folder named takeout. And inside this folder will now be all of the files that we downloaded from Google takeout split across all of those zip files. And they will all be arranged in their correct folders and everything inside here. So now you're really done. You've now merged all of those files together. One last thing you probably want to do is you still have this merging folder here and the takeout folder is inside it. So you might want to come in here and drag the takeout folder and just put it back in your downloads or something. Then you can delete the merging folder and just have the takeout folder just to make it a bit neater. Not absolutely necessary, but you probably just want to do that anyway. But now you're done. You now have one takeout folder with all your takeout files merged together perfectly. So hopefully you found this video helpful and to me I'll see you in another one in the future.